Hey fellas. Alright. Oh. Getting a little shallow. Back in the channel. So we got about a dozen fish in there. And we are gonna hook them up. Let's see what takes it. Right out there in that channel where it starts deeper. Yep. Let's see how that goes. Fishing in paradise. So way out there we got our pilchard on a baba and we got it hooked up to the saltiga 300 yards of 65 pound to a 60 fluoro start off with fluoro once we get bitten off by a toothy critter if they're around i'll switch to wire but uh let's see what we get with this fluoro and just attacked it he got away though See if uh, I'll go for it a second time. Then <laughs> just took it. I don't know if he was toothy or not, but he took just the bait. Uh, it may be a mistake not switching the wire, but we'll see. Guys, we are on. Doesn't feel too big. <laughs> Little Jack. I'm gonna hold on to you for bait. Do I hold on to you for bait? I already have bait. Dying. Got just two huge sharks right there. They're gonna go for my bait. Look at them go! I'm just letting, letting them play with it. They're gonna rip me off for sure. <sighs> Look at them, man. Wow, they're just, there's two of them. Like, I don't know if they're buddies, probably. Something was fighting it. I don't know if our dude is still there. something oh, maybe not maybe I'm seeing things Mac on I got the leader loose he's not oh <laughs> funner this way hey buddy Spanish mackerel for dinner. That's for sure. Check them out, guys. Spanish mackerel. Oh, he's gonna bite me. He's a beauty. All right, let's get him taken care of. Yep. 
another one. Oh, he got off. Another one got lucky. Alright guys, we retied it for, we got one more bait left. I could probably go get more, but I'm going to call it a day. Come back out tomorrow, maybe do some land fishing. Let's see. All right, we got one last bait left. Maybe this is a lucky one. We got something big. Okay, here we go, baby. Please, no shark. something here yeah what do we got nice size huh yeah. oh my I hope it doesn't break off I know, I don't have, uh, no wire right braid all the way up to the, uh, to the hook on my oh it's braid all the way yeah oh, okay I, I popped it and I didn't have a uh, like a wire on this one oh, so this guy this guy was hungry oh yes <laughs> This is what it's all about right here. Oh, you think so? Yeah. Well, maybe it's a... Maybe it's a, like a... Oh! Yeah, no, no. It's a, you know, sharks do that. Yeah, hey, he did, last year, I'll, I tied out, retied all day. Yeah, yeah. But it, it gives you some fun, you know? But still. Oh, yeah. I, I've been losing him on 44-pound uh, wire. Probably. I think I got uh, 61 pounds. Mm. Right here. This one's, uh, I think, 125 pounds. Yeah. This is like for the day where I really want to do it. But it, today is not the day. Today is not the day. Right, I'll, I'll see what I get on the other side. Just hooked that guy up some uh, live bait. He only had lures on him and, and dead bait. And within 30 seconds, you guys saw he hooked up to it, Jack. All right, we're back at the launch. That was a successful outing. Got live bait, got mackerels, got a, well, lost a shark. Got some uh, jack balls. Got even a mangrove snapper, two of them, and by accident. But hey, why not? So, now we're gonna go see whatever other fishy stuff we could do, whether it's uh, nighttime tarpon hunting or uh, just throwing some lures at the beach. We shall see. Catch you soon. Guys, <laughs> I caught an eel. Do you see what I just caught? Oh man, I don't know a lot about these. Holy schmoly.